Okay, back by popular demand. Hello, everybody. <laughs> um, my mom, who turned 97 in June, you know that, she made a decision a few weeks ago. Mom, what did you decide? Well, I decided I was not going to drive anymore. Wow. Yes. How, how did you come to that decision? Well, you know what, Gary? There comes a time where you have to say to yourself, how long is long? I'm 97. I've driven a long time. My record is perfect. I've never had a ticket. Now's the time to stop driving. <laughs> You're going out on top. You know, you have to sort of reconcile things in your mind. And you also have to be proactive, which I have tried to be my entire life. And when I thought about giving up driving, I thought, you know, 97, it's time. There's a time and place for everything. And it was time to give up driving. Let, let, me, let me ask you something. Um, I, I happen to know how proactive you are and uh, planful. So what's the alternative to driving? What are you doing? There are so many things available to seniors. There are, you can go by chats, you can go by circle of care, you can take a taxi. And in the end, I think it's even much cheaper when you give up your car. I haven't been driving my car in the last few months. To tell you the truth, I haven't missed it one bit. I've gone shopping. I've gone with chats. I've gone with circle of care. Excuse me for just a second. I just want to let people know that uh, chats, circle of care, these are driving services, um, somewhat public driving services that are subsidized. You, you phone ahead and you can make an appointment yes. for a ride. Yes. Yeah. Yes. How did you find them? Well, you know, I've known about them for so long. Mm. And uh, through various pamphlets and information. And okay. So that uh, I've known about these services. And the services, by the way, are excellent. The drivers are courteous, helpful. And uh, I really don't miss driving. And don't get me wrong, I enjoy driving, very much so. But as I said before, there comes a time where you have to say to yourself, enough is enough, this is it. So, so folks, this is my mother. Um, I'm blessed because she's self-governing. I don't know if that's the right word, but she's always had this tremendously good judgment. Uh, and as she said, no collisions, no tickets, but she recognizes in herself that, okay, enough's enough. And she put her own plans in place for alternate services. Mom, I so love you. I love you too very, very much, <laughs> Gary. You're terrific. Oh my God, look at where I get it. <laughs> look at where I get it. <laughs> Just stay safe, everybody. And also, those seniors who are still driving, my recommendation, my suggestion, is think about it. And know when it's time to say, I will give up driving. Be safe. And also think of others on the road, because you never know. So take care, everybody. Stay safe. Be well. Love you all. Bye, folks. Bye-bye.